Hello everybody and welcome to my course about how to create a custom 2D physics engine using HTML and JavaScript. Um, in this course um, we're going to start our first part is going to be um, creating a well a index HTML file where we can um, draw everything basically. Okay, and um, I already um, created a folder where I want to put my engine in and I'm basically creating another folder. I'm just call it engine. And in this one, I press new file and I'm going to create, um, well, I call it main HTML. You can call it index HTML. Um, it doesn't matter. Um, you need that file if you want to start basically uh, you know if you want to um see what's going on so if you want uh if you yeah to start the engine <laughs> all right um so let's create that okay the first things uh we need to do so basically we just want to have a canvas and a section where we can put our script to uh, run the engine and to see our example scenes for example and first, um, like in every other um, HTML um, project, we need to declare a doc type HTML and then the classic HTML um, things. Yeah. Um, ah, yeah, there you go. Okay, then, um, well, actually, we don't need that. What I'm going to do now, oh, oops. Yeah, that's uh, one thing I probably. I'm let it on for this episode. That's GitHub Autopilot, um, but you know, he, um, GitHub Autopilot just auto com auto complete auto complete, um, yeah, uh, what you want to write, and I just need to press tap, and it's in. That's pretty cool, but um, I'm not gonna use it in this tutorial. So, um, the next thing, I want to add a meta child set. And that now you see again, that's the exact thing I want to add. But it's just for this episode, I'm going to turn it off in the next one. Then we want to have a title. And I call it not engine, I'm going to call it to the physics engine. All right. Then um we have a style why do we have a style um because uh we want to center the canvas i mean you don't need a style really but it's just a bit prettier and it's not much to add it's just a padding uh with zero and a margin with zero and that's basically everything well except the canvas um and yeah it's basically these things um i give it a margin of 20 pixels and that's the all that's all of the styling yeah uh oh yeah and did i forgot the hat yeah i forgot the closing tag for the hat right then i'm gonna add it too nice um and then we're gonna add the body there we go and then the probably one of them yeah the most important part is the canvas just add in a canvas um Yeah, I, I, I guess uh, we don't. Yeah, actually, we need a ca uh, an ID, but I will call this. Uh, oops, I call this my canvas. You can call it um, any name you like, but we need to access that canvas later on, so you probably need to change that name. Then I'm gonna add a width of. Uh, let's say 1280 and the height of yeah 
720 and close the canvas tag. And then the last thing for the first episode is our script section. We're not including any scripts now. We're going to do that in the next episode. And that's basically everything. Um, if you start it now, you probably, uh, maybe, yeah, probably you'll see just almost nothing. Um, to start it, maybe I can just double click here. No. Okay, I'm going to just uh, open it in my file explorer and let's see how is it looking. Yeah, that's the thing um, you wanted to have. You can add uh, another color. So if you want to add another color, um, there you go, a red one. Um, just don't forget to save it and oh <laughs> well we need to save and we need to refresh the site there we go and yeah that's the first episode um i'm gonna change the color back to white um and see you in the next one